Conodonts are an extinct class of animals whose feeding apparatuses called teeth or elements are common microfossils found in strata dating from the stage 10 of the Furongian, the fourth and final series of the Cambrian, to the Rhetian stage of the Late Triassic. These elements can be used alternatively to or in correlation with other types of fossils graptolites, trilobites, ammonites, in the subfield of the stratigraphy named biostratigraphy. Paleozoic <inaudible> conodonts <inaudible> 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 Topic: Cambrian conodonts. It is suggested that Eoconodontus notchpicensis can be a marker of the stage 10 of the Furongian, the fourth and final series of the Cambrian. In 2006, a working group proposed the first appearance of Cordylodus andresi. Currently the first appearance of E. notchpicensis is favored by many authors because it is globally widespread and is independent of facies known from continental rise to paratidal environments. The Eoconodontis notchpicensis proposal would also incorporate a non-biostratigraphic marker to correlate the beginning of stage 10 globally. A carbon isotope excursion the herb event occurs in the lower part of the E. notchpicensis range. <laughs> Ordovician conodonts <laughs> Early Ordovician The base of the Tremadocean, the lowest stage of Ordovician, is defined as the first appearance of Iapetognathus fluctivagus at the GSSP section in Newfoundland. No conodont species is associated with the Floyan, the second stage of the Ordovician. Topic: <laughs> Middle Ordovician. The base of the Dapingian, the third stage of the Ordovician, is defined as the first appearance of Baltoniodus triangularis. The base of the Darywillian, the fourth stage of the Ordovician, lies just above the North Atlantic Microsarcordina parva conodont zone. The base also lies in the upper part of the North American Histiodella altifrons conodont zone. The Wytrock stage refers mainly to the early Middle Ordovician in North America. It is often used in the older literature in a global sense. The Wytrock stage is given a range from 471.8 ca. 472 to 462 meters y a, spanning close to 10 million years. Officially its start is defined by the potentially lowest occurrence of the conodont Protoprioniodus aranda or Baltoniodus triangularis. <laughs> Late or division No conodont species is associated with the Sandbian, the Cation, nor with the Hernanshan, the fifth, sixth and seventh and final stages of the Ordovician. Baltoniodus gerde has been found in the early Sandbian bromide formation, in Oklahoma, USA. Silurian conodonts Topic <laughs> 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 
The Clandovery epoch lasted from 443.8 plus or minus 1.5 to 433.4 plus or minus 2.8 Maya, and is subdivided into three stages: the Rudanian, lasting until 440.8 million years ago; the Aeronian, lasting to 438.5 million years ago; and the the Telichian late Clandovery of Estonia can be defined by five conodont zones Terraspathodus eopenatus ssp, n, 1, p eopenatus ssp, n. 2, p amorphognathoids angulatus, p a, lenarti and p a, lithuanicus. Topic Wenlock. The Wenlock, which lasted from 433.4 plus or minus 1.5 to 427.4 plus or minus 2.8 Maya, is subdivided into the Shanewoodian to 430.5 million years ago and Homerian ages. The Shanewoodian Wenlock is defined between the Acritarch Biozone 5 and the last appearance of Terraspathodus amorphognathoids. The global boundary stratotype point is in Hewley Brook in Apedale, UK. Topic: <laughs> Ludlow The Ludlow, lasting from 427.4 plus or minus 1.5 to 423 plus or minus 2.8 Maya, comprises the Gaustian stage, lasting until 425.6 million years ago, and the Ludfordian stage. Topic: Predely. Topic: Devonian conodonts. Topic: <laughs> Early Devonian. The Early Devonian lasts from 419.2 plus or minus 2.8 to 393.3 plus or minus 2.5 and begins with the Lokovian stage, which lasts until the Pragian. This spans from 410.8 plus or minus 2.8 to 407.6 plus or minus 2.5, and is followed by the Emsian, which lasts until the Middle Devonian begins. 393.3 plus or minus 2.7 million years ago. Topic. Middle Devonian The Middle Devonian comprises two subdivisions, the Aphalian giving way to the Givetian 387.7 plus or minus 2.7 million years ago. <laughs> Late Devonian Finally, the Late Devonian starts with the Frasnian, 382.7 plus or minus 2.8 to 372.2 plus or minus 2.5, followed by the Famenian subdivision, the beginning and end of which are marked with extinction events. This lasted until the end of the Devonian, 358.9 plus or minus 2.5 million years ago. During that stage, a biologic event occurred Upper Kalwasser extinction of all Ancyridella and Ozarcordina and most Palmatolopus, Polygnathus and Ancyrognathus. 
The Famenian 372.2 plus or minus 1.6 Maya is defined by a GSSP golden spike located at Kumiak Quarry, Montagne Noire, France, where there is a biologic abundant occurrence of Palmatolypus triangularis. Topic: <laughs> Carboniferous conodonts. Topic: Mississippian, also known as Lower Carboniferous. The Tournerician, the oldest age of the Mississippian, contains eight conodont biozones. The zone of Natidus pseudosomyglaba and Scaliognathus ancoralis. The zone of Natidus semiglaba and Polygnathus communis. The zone of Dolimai borcati. The zone of Natidus typicus and Siphonodea isostitia. The zone of Siphonodea quadruplicata and Petrognathus andersoni. Upper zone of Petrognathus andersoni. The lower zone of Petrognathus andersoni. The zone of Petrognathus variabilis. The zone of Petrognathus crassus thvisian, the second age of the Mississippian, contains four conodont biozones. The zone of Locria nodosa. The zone of Locria mononodosa. The zone of Natidus bilineatus. The zone of Natidus texanus serpukovian, the third or youngest age of the Mississippian, includes four conodont biozones. The zone of Natidus postbilineatus. The zone of Natidus bolandensis. The zone of Locria cruciformis. The zone of Locria zeglari. Topic: Pennsylvanian, also known as Upper Carboniferous. The Bashkirian, the oldest age of the Pennsylvanian, contains six biozones based on conodont index fossils. The zone of Neognathodus atocarensis. The zone of Declinognathodus marginodosus. The zone of Idiognathodus sinuosus. The zone of Neognathodus ascanensis. The zone of Idiognathoids sinuatus. The zone of Declinognathodus nodulifrust base of the Moscovian, the second stage in the Pennsylvanian, is close to the first appearances of the conodonts Declinognathodus donatzianus and Idiognathoids postsulcatus. A proposal is to use the first appearance of the conodont Diplognathodus elsmiensis, but since the species is rare and its evolution relatively unknown, it has not been accepted yet. The Moscovian can biostratigraphically be divided into five conodont biozones. The zone of Neognathodus roundi and Streptognathodus cancellosus. The zone of Neognathodus medexultimus and Streptognathodus consonus. The zone of Streptognathodus dissectus. The zone of Neognathodus uralicus. The zone of Declinognathodus donatzianus. Top of the Casimovian, the third stage in the Pennsylvanian, is close to the first appearance of the conodont Streptognathodus zethus. The Casimovian is subdivided into three conodont biozones. The zone of Idiognathodus teretzianus. The zone of Idiognathodus sagittatus. The zone of Streptognathodus excelsus and Streptognathodus maclinarethae base of the Jalian, the youngest age of the Pennsylvanian, is at the first appearance of Streptognathodus zethus. 
The top of the stage, the base of the Permian system, is at the first appearance of Streptognathodus isolatus within the Streptognathus Weborn census chronicline. The Jalian stage is subdivided into five biozones based on the conodont genus Streptognathodus. The zone of Streptognathodus Wabornsensis and Streptognathodus bellus The zone of Streptognathodus simplex The zone of Streptognathodus vagilicus The zone of Streptognathodus vitali The zone of Streptognathodus simulator Permian conodonts Topic Sigiralian The base of the Acelian stage is at the same time the base of the Sigiralian series and the Permian system it is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Streptognathodus isolatus first appear. The top of the Acelian stage, the base of the Sacmarian stage, is at the first appearance of conodont species Streptognathodus postfusus. The Acelian contains five conodont biozones. The zone of Streptognathodus bascovi. The zone of Streptognathodus postfusus The zone of Streptognathodus fusus The zone of Streptognathodus constrictus The zone of Streptognathodus isolatus the base of the Sacmarian stage is laid with the first appearance of Streptognathodus postfusus in the fossil record the top of the Sacmarian, the base of the Artenskian, is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Sweetognathus whitea and Mesogondylella bicelli first appear. The base of the Artenskian stage is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Sweetognathus whitea and Mesogondylella bicelli first appear. The top of the Artenskian, the base of the Kingurian, is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Neostreptognathodus pnevi and Neostreptognathodus exculptus first appear. The base of the Kingurian stage is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Neostreptognathodus pnevi and Neostreptognathodus exculptus first appear. The top of the Kingurian, the base of the Rhodian and the Guadalupian series, is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Ginnagondylella nangankensis first appear. The Kingurian contains three conodont biozones The zone of Neostreptognathodus sulcoplicatus The zone of Neostreptognathodus prei The zone of Neostreptognathodus pnevi Guadalupian <inaudible> 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 The base of the Rhodian is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Ginnagondylella nankingensis first appears. The top of the Rhodian, the base of the Wardian stage, is at the first appearance of fossils of Ginnagondylella acerata. The base of the Wardian stage is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Ginnagondylella acerata first appear. The top of the Wardian, the base of the Capitanian stage, is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where Ginnagondylella postserrata first appears. The base of the Capitanian stage is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where fossils of Ginnagondylella postserrata first appear. 
The top of the Capitanian, the base of the Wachiapingian and Lopingian series, is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where Clarkina postbittery postbittery first appears. The Capitanian contains three conodont biozones. The zone of Clarkina postbittery Hongshiensis. The zone of Ginagondolella altudorensis. The zone of Ginagondolella postserrata. Topic: Lopingian. The base of the Wachiapingian stage is defined as the place in the stratigraphic record where Clarkina postbittery postbittery first appears. The top of the Wachiapingian, the base of the Changsengian, is at the first appearance of conodont species Clarkina wangi. The base of the Changsengian stage is at the first appearance of Clarkina wangi. The top of the Changsengian, the base of the Induan stage and the Triassic system, is at the first appearance of Hindiadis parvus. Topic: Mesozoic conodonts. Topic: <laughs> Early Triassic. The base of the Induan stage, which is also the base of the Lower Triassic series, the base of the Triassic system and the base of the Mesozoic erythem, is defined as the place in the fossil record where Hindiadis parvus first appears. The base of the Olenikian is at the lowest occurrence of Neospathodus wageni. It is defined as ending near the lowest occurrences of Chiocella timorensis. Topic: <inaudible> Middle Triassic. The base of the Anisian stage, also the base of the Middle Triassic series, is sometimes laid at the first appearance of Chiocella timorensis in the stratigraphic record. The top of the Anisian, the base of the Ladinian, is at the first appearance of Neogondolella prehungarica. The Ladinian is defined by the first appearance of Budurovignathus prehungaricus. Upper Triassic The top of the Carnian the base of the Norian is at the conodont biozones of Metapolygnathus communisti or Metapolygnathus primitius. The Norian stage begins at the base of the conodont biozones of Metapolygnathus communisti and Metapolygnathus primitius. The top of the Norian, the base of the Rishan, is close to the first appearance of Masikaea spp. and Epigondolella mosheri. The Aluunian, also known as Middle Norian, is a sub-age in the Upper Triassic. It begins with the first appearance of Cypridodella multidentata. The stage ends with the first appearance of Cypridodella bidentata.